Ah, Jeff Dodds, a nationally touring comedian, actor, host, prankster, and Bigfoot enthusiast. I, I gotta right. find out more about that. He's he's bringing a good time to the Liberty Funny Bone this weekend. <laughs> Out Season's greetings. Yeah. Thanks for having me. Oh yeah. man, I, I wish you could have been with us during the commercial. I've break. been waiting to say this all morning. Good morning, Cincinnati. There yeah. you go. You nailed it. You nailed it. There we go. Can we start with Bigfoot enthusiasts Bigfoot, yeah. just because I'm curious? Yeah. Well, I would say Bigfoot expert, but I don't know if he's real. So everybody, <laughs> you know. But I'm just obsessed with Bigfoot. I'm from Seattle. Seattle area. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. it. That's what you do. Yeah. Right. In that's Seattle. all. I just love Bigfoot. Bigfoot. That's, yeah. that's, that's all so, it takes. I mean, but I, let's take this a step further. What okay. do you do to to uh, uh, sort of deal with your love of Bigfoot? What do you? I do? just read stuff about him and look him up on the internet. <laughs> I don't go in the woods, man. <laughs> <laughs> I, li I, live, I live in a building, you know? <laughs> I live in a building. Bigfoot ain't roaming around North Hollywood. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're, you're, you're busy outside of Seattle. No, I, mean, right. I mean, doing, uh, obviously, TV stuff all the yeah. time. Yeah. You know, just recently hanging out with Henry Winkler and Terry Bradshaw and all those guys. Yeah. That had to have been kind of Season fun. Season two is coming up soon. I love it. We, we leave in May. We don't know where we're going. They won't tell us. But uh, it should be good. It's going to be fun. Well, you, you got to see the world, too. Not only hang out with those guys, you got to go to some cool places. Absolutely. Too. That's the best part. Or not the best part, but like I like that we just get to see the world. Like, yeah, the more man. I see the world, the, like, it's, I realize it's way America. America's good, yeah. but everything else is good too. Yeah. It's nice. Mm -hmm. The world's good. That's cool. Yeah. That's cool. They laugh at your jokes over there too. No, they don't like, get my jokes. Oh, okay. Yeah, I stick to the jokes in America because I try, and they just go, "Well, this guy's an idiot." <laughs> <laughs> when you're when you're going around, are you are you able to take though any of those experiences you had and put them into your show? Do you oh yeah, yeah. I talk about it a lot on stage. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Rock on. Rock on. <laughs> but it's all nice, you know. I I don't, you know, it's not like racist or nothing. I'm like these Asian people. It's not like that. It's a good show. Good. Oh, well, yeah. It's probably a good. I don't want people to think he's probably going to make fun of the Japanese or something, you know. So he's not going to do that. I wouldn't do that. So are you. When you have your show, you gonna make fun of us? Yeah, probably. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, you guys are delightful. I like it here. Yeah. What What do you do, What do you like better? Do you like being uh, to get that immediate response from a crowd when you're mm -hmm. foreign? Do you like the TV stuff? What's best for you? I like TV, um, but I think stand-up comedy is my favorite because I can say whatever I want. Yeah, ah. yeah, that's what I like best. I, no matter if I'm grumpy, tonight will be a grumpy show. If yeah. I'm happy, it'll be. So it's like I like that freedom to just say whatever. The only censor is yourself. That's when you're right. On your show. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's not better late than never. I've got to like, you know, they decide at the end, like if they, what they can edit and what they can keep in. When I take over for America's Got Talent, you yeah. know, when, uh, Nick Cannon's Nick job, Cannon, I heard about uh, that. when I take that job, oh. uh, I'll probably won't be able to say whatever I want either, you know? Well, he, he wasn't. Yeah, <laughs> no, yeah, yeah he wasn't saying to either, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff, you're a good dude, man. I Thanks for having me. You guys yeah, are the Thanks for coming in. I've uh, often been described as the Chris Sabo of comedy, you know? Yeah. So. <laughs> Do you wear the goggles? Yeah. You, that's yeah, you, I tell jokes with goggles. Yeah. those goggles. Heck yeah, you would. I oh, love man, it. you just automatically got you an audience. Yeah, both. You're done. Yeah, Sold yeah, out yeah, every yeah, single yeah. one right now. And there are two shows tonight, uh, two shows tomorrow, and one show on Sunday. I'll let the Liberty Funny Moment. Thanks so much for coming. You guys are the best. Thanks nice for having me. Yeah, so best of luck out there. It's uh